Hey everyone, it's Even Bigger Jono. Welcome back to more Pokemon Silver. Last time we looked around Golden Road City, guys. Um, in this video, we're gonna take oh, I'm right, gonna take on the gym. Uh, at the moment our team is this. Obviously, we're not using Oddish or Togepi. I just haven't really been bothered to put them in the PC. Um, so effectively our team is just Qualava and Wooper. We will be catching a new Pokemon very soon, so keep an eye out for that. Uh, we're obviously going to fight all the trainers in this gym, because like I said, last time we fought a gym leader, it's recommended. Uh, oh, you're a cute trainer. I like you, but I won't hold back. Alright. Alright, hero. What's your name? Tell me your name. Beauty Victoria. Alright, so what do you got? Centret. Yeah, they have a level 9, level 13, and a level 17 Centret from memory. Alright, let's just go ahead and kill it. Oh, yay, we're faster than it. Wow. Alright, well, that's that. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Alright, another Centret. And we'll go ahead and hit. Oh, it's faster than it. So let's go ahead and use Defense Girl. That's probably not good. Which means we probably won't be able to one hit KO this thing now. It's kind of a shame. Oh, we probably wouldn't have done that anyway. Alright, lucky for Whoopers, good defense stat. And. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Uh, alright. Oh, wait. What? We're fast? Okay, whatever. Oh, wait, no. Last turn it used Quick Attack. Oh, well, I'm still kind of surprised that we're faster than it. Alright, level 9. We are one level away from evolving into Quagsire, which is what I want before we get to, uh, to um, Whitney, which would probably happen. Alright, another Centrist is level 17. Let's go ahead and use Headbutt. And oh, that's all right. No, I hate this. Oh god! Come on! Are you joking? It hit five times. That's some bullshit. Ah, uh, thanks, Sentry. You're an ass. We were going so well that battle as well. Like, we didn't really take too much damage. You know, things were going quite nicely, and then we had to take like a fuck ton of damage from the Fury cut uh, Fairy Cutter. Very, very swipes, what am I saying? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and use this potion here. Won't get us quite the full health, but it's kind of back to where we were before uh, uh, Fury Swipes came into play. Alright, I don't even know where the hell I was going just then. Alright, let's just go ahead and head over here. By the way, this gym, if you look at it from like an aerial angle, it looks like a Clefairy, which is pretty cool. Give it your best shot or I'll take you down. Uh, I believe this trainer has a bunch of Meowth, if I'm not mistaken. This is a normal type gym, by the way, in case you hadn't already noticed. Um, I recommend coming in here with a fighting type if you've got one already. Uh, if not, there is nothing else that's super effective against it, so any type will do, except for Ghost, obviously. Ghost can't hit normal type Pokemon. Great, thanks for using Growl, you ass. Alright. So this does. Ah. Oh. Um. Tail whip, I guess. No, stop, for God's sake. I fucking hate it when the AI just starts doing this. Uh, yeah, I really want to give Whooper the experience point, so I'm just like... You know, holy shit, critical. Of course it was. Oh, and of course I flinched. Fucking hell. Alright, um... We've got a lot of super potions. Let's go ahead and use it. Use that. Yay, it failed. Alright, we'll go one more tail whip just to get things back on level with each other, I guess. How does growl miss, by the way? It's a freaking sound. Like, sound missing is deserving. Fuck you. Ah, we still could take it out. Alright, let's just go ahead and use water gun. Alright, please take it out, I swear to god. Thank you. Alright, and another Meowth. We'll go ahead into Qualava for this. Alright, Qualava's pretty close to level 20 actually, that's pretty cool too. I recommend being around level 20, uh, for your whole team, that is, uh, when you go ahead and fight Whitney in this gym, by the way, because, um, her strongest Pokemon is level 20, and it's a mill tank, so, yeah, I recommend being at least level 20 when you come to this gym. 
No, owe me up. I'm so sorry. No, you're not. You were being an ass that whole battle. Fucking hell. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, use the fresh water here. Why am I using so many items? The Pokemon Center is literally just outside. Ah, <laughs> uh, whatever. I don't really care. Uh, we're gonna be rich after this gym anyway. Don't think I'm a pushover. <laughs> like how they just say this, like, you know, our characters mute. Well, they're not mute, but like, they, they don't they don't talk or anything like that, so... Ah, uh, it's funny. Alright, we've got Snubble here. Let's go ahead and use Mudslap, I guess. No, please don't paralyze me. Oh, thank God. Let's go ahead and use Mudslap to get its accuracy down a little bit. Just to make this fight a little less annoying. Fuck! God, why? Why'd the critical hit do pretty much the same amount of damage as the actual attack? No, 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 no! Thank God that missed. Alright. I hate it when they use charm. Alright, let's go one more time. Because charm, uh, it lowers your attack stat by two stages. Flinched! Ah! Yeah, I'm already slower than you. Why should I lower my speed? Wow, we haven't even been hit by a par paralysis yet. I think. Oh wow, we took it out. Incredible. God, what was with the arse experience point? So I was level 18. Darn, I thought you were weak. Well, you thought wrong. All right, there is one more trainer we got to fight in this gym. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and heal Whipper up again. Uh, Paralyzed Hill. And then after we fight this trainer, uh, we're gonna go ahead and heal. I like cute Pokemon better than strong Pokemon, but I have strong and cute Pokemon. I think she's got three Jigglypuff, actually. That's kind of annoying. <laughs> and they're all level 15, and they all know Sting. Yeah, it's gonna be a shit time. Alright, let's go ahead and use Headbutt here. And did about half. No! Nah, thank god, okay. Alright. Thank god we're faster than this thing, actually. That's good. Alright, excellent. Alright, one more battle and we will be level 20. Actually, we can probably safely switch into Quilava for this, so they'll both level up. Alright, let's go ahead and use Ember. Yeah, it's kind of a shame we don't actually have a fighting type Pokemon, because this gym is an absolute... Uh, thank god that missed. Okay. This gym is an absolute joke if you have a, if you have a fighting type Pokemon, but I have another strategy that I'm going to be using, so... It's never really failed me before. Alright, level 20. Oh, what? Whoopie didn't level up? What the hell? Oh, wait, no, I switched before it, didn't I? Wow, I'm an idiot. Yeah, no, I switched... <laughs> what am I doing? I should have... I should have switched after they switched into Jigglypuff. Wow, I'm a dumbass. I did not mean for that to happen. Nevertheless, uh, as long as Whipper wins this, uh, we will be a level 20. Accuracy fell, very nice. And it's missing, hooray! Alright guys, and that's that. Whoop will grow to level 20. I'm gonna go ahead and heal at the Pokemon Center once the whole evolution process is over. Mostly because you don't want to be going into this fight with a weak, weak team, so... What? Whooper is evolving! Yay, at last! Awesome, we have a mainstay, and it's Quagsire. That's what I love about Wooper, it evolves pretty early into a pretty strong Pokemon. Alright, I'll be right back guys, I'm gonna go ahead and heal up the Pokemon. Alright, right, my friends, we've arrived at what people consider to be the toughest gym leader in Johto, and I don't know why. Alright, hi, I'm Whitney. Everyone was into Pokemon, so I got into it too. Pokemon are super cute. You wanna battle? I'm warning you, I'm good. Alright, so this is Whitney here, guys. She has two Pokemon, obviously she's a normal type Pokemon trainer. Uh, her first Pokemon here is going to be Clefairy. It'll be level 18. Uh, it'll have, I believe... One second. Uh, let's go ahead and use Ember here. See if we can burn it, actually. If we can burn this in, that'll be great. Nope, never mind. Double slap, and yay, it missed! Haha! 
All right, anyway, uh, this thing has Encore, Mimic, Double Slap, and Metronome. So, kind of an annoying moveset, actually. Encore is the move that'll, like, force you to keep using your move, your, the move that you use last between two to five turns, which is, which can be really shitty sometimes. Um, but it depends on what the AI decides to do, I guess. Anyway, well, that was pretty easy. What the hell? Goodbye, Wooper. <laughs> Wooper. Goodbye, Clefairy. Alright, her last quick one here is going to be Miltank. This is the thing that people seem to have problems with. But my strategy is going to eliminate that. Miltank... Ah, oh, pardon me. Miltank will be level 20 with Stomp, Attract, Milk Drink, and Rollout. Try and avoid attack. I mean, Attract and Rollout uh, is not very effective on Quagsire. Um, so it's probably going to try and Stomp... Stomp and Milk... Whoa, what the hell? I'm choking. Uh, Alright, let's go ahead. We resist that. Um... Mudslap like this thing to get its accuracy down, just to stop that rollout combo, and also because Stomp's a very annoying attack. Rollout will uh, double in power every time it's using Succession, so it's kind of like uh, Fairy Cutter, so or Fury Cutter, whatever the hell they want to call it. Okay, well its accuracy is now lowered three stages. Let's hope that Rollout starts missing a little bit. <laughs> there we go, it's starting to miss now. All right. Uh, it, you'll probably find that uh, they'll start spamming the crap out of Milk Drink. That's fine. Just let them do that. Uh, we have plenty of PP to mess around here. Um, it can uh, You can lower it up to a maximum of six stages. Oh, wow. It hit. What the hell? Alright. So we've lowered it six stages. Its accuracy can't go any lower. Uh, she's probably going to start spamming Milk Drink now. So let's go ahead and use Headbutt. There it is. Yeah, Milk Drink is like recover, it'll recover 50% of your HP, but I have a way around that. We've got Tail Whip here to lower its defense, so that'll make Headbutt and Mud Scythe, if I choose to alternate, uh, do a little bit more. God, what? Come on, your accuracy is like as low as it can possibly get. Why are you hitting? Uh, it's looking kind of dangerous. I'm going to go ahead and heal here real quick, actually. Mostly because I really don't want Quagsire to faint here. Plus, if she can heal, then so can I. So, alright. No, 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 no. Okay, thank God. Alright, good. It's missing a lot. Alright, so its defense is down three stages. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and try Headbutt again. Let's see what this does. And, alright, that's doing about half. So if she heals, we know it's just going to eliminate that. Which is what she does, and we're back up to pretty much where we were. <laughs> and, ah, uh, You know what, let's use Tailwhip one more time, just to stop that from happening. We're kind of screwed if, like, she heals again this turn, though, which she's probably going to. Uh, headbutt. No, it went for Stomp. Alright, well, it's probably going to faint this turn, because we've lowered us to defense another stage. And yes! Alright. We didn't really have any forms at all that fight. Hard my ass. Sob. Wow, you're mean. You shouldn't be serious. Uh, you child, you, whatever. Okay. Wow, wow. You meanie. Okay, if you go to leave, this trainer here will stop you. Oh no, you made Whitney cry. It's okay, she'll stop soon. She always cries when she loses. Wow. Cry, baby. <sighs> what? What do you want? A badge? Oh right, I forgot. Here's plain badge. All right, so we got our third badge, guys. Well, that's kind of funny because like it took like six episodes between our first and second, and like only two episodes between our second and third. Plain badge lets you use Pokemon strength outside the move strength, sorry, outside of battle. It also boosts your Pokemon speed. Oh, you could have this too. TM45 is attract, guys. Uh, basically, what it does is uh, it kind of acts like. Um, paralysis, but it only affects Pokemon of the opposing gender. Yeah. Uh, Alright, well we got our third badge, guys. We're going to end the video there. It's been a pretty eventful episode, so next time on Pokemon Silver, we're going to head out and north of Goldenrod City, alright? See you guys then.